A steel re-rolling mill is a facility that takes raw steel ingots or billets and processes them into finished steel products, primarily through the process of rolling. Here's a general overview of how a steel re-rolling mill works. Raw material preparation. The process starts with the procurement of raw materials, which typically include steel billets or ingots. These raw materials are inspected for quality and then stored in the mill's storage area. Heating. The next step is to heat the raw material to a specific temperature for it to become malleable. This is usually done in a reheating furnace, where the steel is heated to a high temperature, typically around 1,100 to 1,250 degrees Celsius, depending on the type of steel being processed. Rolling. Once the steel is heated, it is fed into a series of rolling stands. These stands consist of a set of large rolls that apply pressure and gradually shape the steel into the desired product. The number of stands and the rolling process vary depending on the desired final product. Repeated rolling and shaping. In a re-rolling mill, the steel is often passed through a series of stands multiple times to achieve the desired shape, size, and thickness. The rolls in each stand gradually reduce the thickness and shape of the steel, making it longer and narrower in the process. Throughout the re-rolling process, quality control measures are implemented to ensure the steel products meet the required specifications. Various tests and inspections, including dimensional checks, surface quality evaluations, and mechanical testing, are conducted to verify the quality and compliance of the finished products. In the case of steel bars, the semi-finished products are typically rolled into long, cylindrical shapes. The process may involve multiple passes through different sets of rollers to achieve the desired dimensions. Cooling. After passing through the rolling mill, the newly formed steel products are usually hot and need to be cooled. This is typically done using water sprays or air cooling systems. The cooling process helps to anneal the steel, relieving any internal stresses and improving its mechanical properties. Finishing operations. Once the steel products have cooled down, they may undergo additional finishing operations, such as straightening, cutting, or surface treatment, to achieve the desired specifications and surface quality. 